July is here and summertime is in full swing, and while you might be keeping busy outside with barbecues and pool parties and camping trips, it's also totally fine with me if you just want to lie on the couch and watch movies until your eyeballs hurt. Luckily, another new month means another new heaping pile of streaming entertainment from Netflix. Here is what's coming to that streaming platform in the good old US of A for July 2018. As always, we'll show you the full list at the end, but first, you have to sit through some of our terrible recommendations. Welcome to Jurassic Park. Hold on to your butts, because just in time for the release of Jurassic World Fallen Kingdom comes the original Jurassic Park trilogy. The first one is perfection, the second one is goofy as hell, and, well, the third one, it has pterodactyls at least. If you prefer your monsters of a more supernatural variety, Van Helsing also hits Netflix, or as I like to call it, Wolverine vs. Dracula. Speaking of famous bloodsuckers, you can also spend some time with The Staten Company in Interview with the Vampire. Have you said your goodbyes to the light? If that all sounds too scary and you want to go make a sandwich, don't worry, because you're not alone. Scooby-Doo and Scooby-Doo Monsters Unleashed both feature the live-action annex of that cowardly dog in the van full of meddling kids he hangs out with. Fun fact, the first Scooby-Doo movie was written by James Gunn, director of the Guardians of the Galaxy movies. We're gonna die! Stay positive! We're gonna die quickly! There are a few other totally unrelated movies dropping this month that I will desperately try to make connections between. Let's see if I can do that. In Swordfish, Hugh Jackman does a huge hack, man. Halle Berry's also in it, so it's basically Wolverine and Storm versus the internet. It's not a good movie, but it's fun. Speaking of Halle Berry, you know who was a better Catwoman than her? Basically everybody. But also Anne Hathaway, star of The Princess Diaries, a nice film where she sadly doesn't dress up like a cat and do any stealthy action stuff. If it's cool stealthy action stuff that you're after, look no further than stealth. A movie where Jamie Foxx and Jessica Biel have to fight an evil stealth bomber controlled by super intelligent AI or something like that. Appropriately enough for a movie about a stealth bomber, nobody saw it, and subsequently it bombed, becoming one of the biggest box office losses in cinematic history. You know what, instead of putting on stealth, why don't you just rewatch Happy Gilmore? That's streaming too. Adam Sandler plays golf and there's an alligator. It's great. Anyway, those were just a few of our choice recommendations. As always, here is the full list. We'll be back in a month, but until then, have a lovely July. And for everything about dinosaurs, vampires, stealth bombers, hacking, and Wolverine, keep it right here on IGN.